So I just got to Beverly Hills, guys. Um, I'm checking at the hotel. Our room isn't ready yet. We got a really nice suite, though, so I'm still carrying the bag with me. Um, but I wanted to show you guys what I'm wearing today. So I got a motorcycle jacket up top, then my uh, John Bravados boots t-shirt with the studs. Got this last time I was in LA. Uh, Louis Vuitton belt. I always like to wear it out on vacation. Uh, red Zara jeans, and then most importantly, the uh, Louboutin black on black spikes. The review on these will be coming um, very soon after I get home. I just didn't have the box and everything with me here, um, so I want to wear them the first day here though. So check out the red bottoms on those. So yeah, also up top, got the vintage LA snapback. I was like to wear it the first day in LA here, and my ray of course. So we've been looking at a couple things. Uh, we'll be going to lunch at the Ivy soon. Yeah, so I'll see you guys soon. Just checked out Lanvin. They have some really cool flower lapel pins. I know not all you guys would be into that kind of thing, but I think they're dope, so I might be purchasing one, th one of those later on in the trip. There you can see two beautiful Rolls Royce ghosts, and one's pulling away. Will the other one catch? Just stopped in Hugo Boss to look at some more casual dress shoes uh, for work, so not so flashy as the uh, Ferragamos. Uh, real quality, gonna be back there, check those out. Once again, Louboutins today. First time wearing them, I'm really excited. Just pull our car on to go to the Ivy, a nice little Maybach 57S right there, and a taxi. But the Maybach's more important. I just had a great lunch at the Ivy. The pasta and pizza there is excellent. Really great. Uh, I'm gonna head to the Louboutin men's store right now. Even though I'm already wearing my favorite pair, I might check out some other ones. Probably won't buy any today though. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna head there and then we're gonna have some great dinner at uh, Riva Bella, which just opened two weeks ago, so I can't wait to try it out. So the suite they gave us has a nice little balcony area right here. You can see uh, that's our room right there. Got the whole hotel all lit up real nice right there. American flag and Rodeo Drive. I just met up with the homie Graham uh, for some sushi at Sugarfish. Really good. You can follow him on Instagram, just Graham. Always posting great pictures, real high-end stuff. Um, so now I'm headed with the family to Riva Bella, which just opened up two weeks ago. I uh, can't wait. Real, some really good Italian cuisine right there. And um, gonna be really good. I'll show you guys what I'm wearing right now. So tonight, guys, I'm gonna start up top of my outfit wearing the LA Raiders hat. You know, I was wearing this during the day. I still love it. Still transitions tonight really well. Then I'm wearing my Zara denim and leather studded jacket. Absolutely love this jacket. Great details. Great fit overall. Then I'm wearing a selection of bracelets tonight. I have on uh, the left wrist, you got Hermes, two bracelets from Kitson. On the right wrist, one bracelet from John Bravados, and then this bracelet I actually got on the streets of New York. Underneath, I'm wearing a uh, Pierre Balmain t-shirt. Very cool, got a couple different colors of gray, some good fading, got some uh, rough detailing, and the fit on it's a bit longer too, which I like, you know, it's unique. Um, goes a little bit below the jacket. Then I have my Zara. Uh, black, formerly waxed, I like to say after re-wax them, you can actually buy something online to re-wax your jeans. Um, but they still look great right now. Most importantly, I have the Louboutins on feet. You can see those red bottoms right there. Love these. Uh, first day I've ever worn them, so I had to wear them at night as well. They just look awesome, and I can't wait to wear them again. So, we're about to go have a great dinner at Riva Bella. I can't wait. I think it's going to be great, and I'll catch up with you guys tomorrow. Got something special for you guys tomorrow. Quite the beautiful McLaren just pulled up with the valet. Truly, truly an amazing car. Look at that. McLaren logo right there. Red lip. Oh, it just looks fantastic. All right, guys. So Fran Elation just picked me up. What's good, guys? Um, so I'll show you guys what we're both wearing uh, for sneakers today when we get out at Supreme. Um, and but then you guys can check out the full video on the Fran on Fran's channel of our day. So, all right, guys. So we're here at Fran Elations. You can see that he's got the uh, the unlucky 13s on feet, and I have the uh, I have the Tiffany lows on feet right there. Yeah. If you want to catch the rest of the video, you're gonna have to check out Fran. We just left Diamond in the Hundreds. Me and Fran each copped a couple things. Um, yeah, so I'll be showing you the guys these at the end of uh, the video. We were going to check out Supreme, but uh, there's a little line because they released some Vans today or something like that, so uh, we won't be going in. Alright, so we finished up in Melrose. Now we're headed to uh, Riff, and we're going to get some food. You can see some of the bags we got, and uh, Fran and Givenchy sweater right there, just lounging around. Uh, yeah, so we're headed to Riff right now. We'll see what we get there. Guys, I just got back to the uh, hotel from a nice uh, day with Fran. Thank you for showing me around, Fran. Really appreciate it. 
It was dope hanging out with you. Make sure you guys go check out our full outfit videos uh, on Fran's channel. I'm um, gonna be headed to dinner right now. Gotta figure out where we're eating tonight. And uh, yeah, just continue on with the vacation. I'll show you guys what I'm wearing tonight. I accidentally took Fran's bag from 4-2 Fairfax and uh, the hundreds. Uh, so uh, he's just swinging back around. He actually got a dope t-shirt from Rude, if you guys know that. Um, but uh, I got to pick up my tank and a t-shirt that I bought from Diamond. So he's swinging back around right now. All right, so now I got my right two bags, the Diamond Spy Co. and hundreds one. You can see the beautiful cars as always, Jaguar XK, Saline Mustang. And such a great day with Fred Relations shopping around LA. I'm going out to dinner. I'm at Asia de Cuba. I can't wait. It's at the Modern Hotel. So I'm dressing up a little bit. I'm wearing a uh, button-down shirt from Zara. It's got this double collar look going on here. Pretty unique. Um, then you move down. Got my favorite, as you know, vacation belt to wear. Louis Vuitton. Don't bring it with me to school, so I always like to wear it on vacation. White uh, Zara. Oh, white Levi's jeans, actually. And then my Hugo Boss Red Loafers. No sneakers tonight. Um, you know, I know you guys don't all like this type of shoe, but I think it looks really good, really classy, dress up a little bit. So, hope you guys enjoy seeing something different, and uh, we'll, we'll be back out tomorrow after a great dinner. The beautiful SLS AMG in this really nice, kind of almost a matte silver here. And then we also have a nice Tesla Roadster, and if you can see back there, a Lamborghini. Very nice. We got a nice two-tone Lambo, got black on the back there. Have a very nice... Uh, Porsche right here, you know, I'm not a huge Porsche guy, but still, you know, I can respect one. And then SLS convertible right there. Real nice lineup of cars, you can see the Escalade right there. Also, um, the dinner uh, tonight was not the greatest, so I wouldn't really recommend that restaurant. Uh, but uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it had a great view, uh, but would not recommend going there. All right, so today I decided to do my outfit a little differently on outfit grid format. So we'll start off with the smallest details. You have a Beyonce. Um, burgundy leather and rose gold plated uh, anchor bracelet. And you have two bracelets I got from Kitson right there. The place I got on the street, John Rivados, and an Hermes bracelet. You have my Gucci wallet, Ray Ban sunglasses, and a hat that I got at my first ASAP Rocky show. Then you have a YSL t shirt in the velvet print logo uh, before they na changed their name to Saint Laurent. Um, then you have my favorite, as you guys know by now, Louis Vuitton belt. My Margiela sneakers, um, one of the, uh, I think it's the first time I'm wearing them actually, and some white Levi's jeans. So there's the look at the outfit overall. Uh, let me know if you guys like this change in the way to the outfit, and I'll be going back to the other way for the rest of the outfits for the trip. Alright, so we're just taking a little walk up Rodeo Drive. Just stopped in uh, Dolce & Gabbana. Really like the pair of sunglasses, might go on those. This is what the Margiela's look like on feet when they're walking. Um, yeah, so we're going to have lunch at Mr. Chow's, and uh, yeah, I'll keep you guys updated on what we're doing today. Just had a fantastic lunch at Mr. Chow, saw Kiefer Sutherland there, that was cool. Um, yeah, so we're just going to head, drive around the hills a little bit, see some of the beautiful homes, maybe here Rodeo and do a little more shopping. Just left Guess, uh, got my mom a really cool uh, neon green leather jacket, you know, it's not all about me. Um, so yeah, we're just going to keep on shopping on Rodeo. You can see Bijan's, uh, well, sadly Bijan died. Bijan's Bugatti, Bijan's son's now Bugatti, and a nice Rolls Royce ghost over there. I know I already featured, I think it might be even maybe this McLaren, but I had to give you guys a second look on it on Rodeo. Truly. Alright guys, so after a great day out and about in Beverly Hills, we're going to go to dinner at Katsuya. I can't wait. Always one of my favorite spots here in LA. So today, I'll start up top. I'm wearing the Seattle Spurs vintage snapback from the 90s. Um, love this hat, great colors. You don't find these colors on a lot of NBA team logos. Um, now we have the Charles and a Half jacket, a uh, wool with the leather sleeves, or well, should I say faux leather, but still very cool looking. Um, next, my uh, my Louis Vuitton T-shirt. You know, one of my favorites. I have to break it out every time I'm here in LA. You know, I love it. I decided to switch it up today because I'm wearing Louis Vuitton T-shirt. The Gucci black Gucci belt, black on black. Love this belt. The white Levi's jeans I was wearing earlier today, and then most importantly. My black and pink Easy Ones. Absolutely love these. You know, it started all on YouTube for me, and uh, I really just absolutely love these shoes. Um, so I always like to wear them out for special occasions and whatnot. So going to Katsu is definitely one of those. I um, hope you guys like this fit. We only have one more day here in LA, but um, I'll be showing you guys my purchases for, purchases for the trip, as well as uh, the rest of the day tomorrow. Thanks, guys. We just had a fantastic dinner at Kitsuya. Always a pleasure to dine here. Great, great service, great food. Truly awesome. I'm uh, gonna head back to the hotel now and uh, wake up tomorrow for our last day. 
Alright guys, so I'm going to show you guys what sneakers I wore here in LA. You have the Nike SB Tiffany's, the black Louboutin Spikes with the red sole, the black Solar Red Easy 2's, I'm wearing those today on my last day, the Margillas in that royal blue metallic right there, looks awesome wearing those tonight actually, and finally the black pink Easy 1's, I wore those out last night to Katsui if you guys remember. So there's a look at all of them. Some of the best uh, from my collection, in my opinion. I love them. I hope you guys do, too. And I'll be taking you guys through my last day here and showing you guys my pickup. Taking our walk up Rodeo, you have a beautiful Ferrari and a nice all-white R8 right there. Really two good-looking cars. Always nice to see them park near each other. First look at the new Ferrari, the 4C Ferrari. Hmm, it actually looks really good in person. I gotta say, it looks unique. But uh, I don't hate it. I don't hate it. Alright guys, so I just left Hugo Boss. I got a really cool pair of shoes. I'll be showing you guys these uh, right at the end of the video. Today I'm wearing my Givenchy um, t-shirt. Zara denim and leather jacket. Uh, some khaki uh, Levi's jeans. And most importantly, the Nike Air Yeezy 2s, the black and silver reds. Only the second time I've ever worn these. I absolutely love them. I took the, uh, the little lace tips off because I didn't want to lose them. But I think they still look great even without them on. So uh, yeah, it's been a great day. I've been doing a little driving around. I've seen more Lamborghinis and Ferraris today than I've seen any other day in uh, Beverly Hills. So it's been a great day so far. Can only get better from here. All right, guys. So I'm going to show you my pickups for this trip. I'm dressed up for dinner tonight. Going out to Boa uh, Steakhouse, excellent steakhouse. We've been there many times, and we can't wait to end our trip there. I'll show, so today I'm wearing the Zara blazer. Very cool, one of my favorite blazers. Have an Etro Pocket Square in, wore this to prom back in high school. Another one of my Beverly Hills pickups, if you guys remember it from that video. John Bravado's vest, uh, another Beverly Hills pickup actually. Um, then I have an uh, Izod shirt on. Very cool shirt, always like that. My favorite, Louis Vuitton belt, white Levi's jeans, and then I'm breaking the Margils out again for dinner. Um, I feel like, you know, they're dressing up to be one with the blazer. Um, but do something different than wear dress shoes. So I really like these a lot. I think they look great and they really complement the look overall. So I hope you guys like this kind of dressy look mixed with some sneakers. And uh, let's get to my pickups. So uh, with Fran, you guys saw these two bags. I got a tank top. 100 tank top. I might wear this to Ultra. Uh, if you guys are going to be an Ultra weekend too, I will be there as well. Um, and yeah, so if you guys see me uh, out there, make sure you say what's up. Very cool tank top, fun colors. You got the hundreds little bomb logo on the back there as well. So overall, just a fun tank top, something simple, not not limited or anything, just a great print from the hundreds. Then uh, Fran and I went over to Diamond Spy Company, and I got two things there. First, got a pair of boxers. I've um, always liked these. I didn't buy them on the website, um, and I saw them in the store, and I had to get them. So overall, diamond print there, cool color, always looking good on that end. And then I saw this logo online and I really wanted it and they just dropped the spring collection. Um, it's uh, off the Chanel um, perfume bottle. It's got diamond spy, diamond number one um, with the diamond top on the bottle and then diamond. Kind of really cool print, um, graphic, uh, sort of vintage looking. I really like it a lot. Um, I don't go for every diamond thing that comes out now because I have so much of it, especially for the mystery boxes. I like the photo tees, I like some of their collaborations, but I really was feeling this tee so I had to get it. But most importantly, I have a pair of shoes from Hugo Boss, as you guys can see on the bag right there. Boss, Hugo Boss. <clears throat> and for these, I'm going to move over here because I feel like the lighting might be a little bit better. And we'll leave these bad boys over here. So. You can see the box right here, just real simple, black box, boss, you go boss right there. And these shoes are really special. Last year, as you guys know, I got the loafers. Um, I really like those a lot. They're really great. And uh, I absolutely love these. These are a great new addition to the collection. Not sneakers at all. Um, something dressier, but something I'm really feeling right now. So as you guys can see, uh, just like a pair of Louboutins, they each come in individual dust bags, and they have a leather tag right here. That says Boss, Hugo Boss right there. Individual drawstrings to protect them. I you know, won't keep them in these bags, but I do like the added details. And here you have the shoes. Now let me get both out before I do the full review. Let's put that in there for now. All right. As you know, I like to review the uh, right foot always, so we'll do that. 
All right, now these shoes are really something. Really high quality suede. Um, they're dressy enough that you could wear them with a suit in a casual manner, or you could wear them, uh, which is a cardigan, button down shirt. So as you can see, you have Boss Hugo Boss back there. Then you have the classic wingtip design with the stamps in right here into the suede. You move forward. You have uh, the patterning right there with all the uh, indents, I mean all the impressions right there. Very, very cool. The suede is very high quality. Absolutely love these. Then move up. Now you have contrast laces. This is what really sold me on the shoes. It's kind of a blue steel, almost a gray. They do come with the regular tan laces, if you're feeling that. Um, I'm definitely going to leave these on. I think they look really good like that. Tan uh, suede tongue. Then you have the same footbed, the tan with the boss, Hugo Boss embossed in there. That's what it is, embossing, that's what I meant. Uh, now you have this really great wood sole. I mean, I just think it looks classic, looks very clean, looks really good. It goes all the way along there. And then, of course, on the bottom, you have this really nice darker brown leather with the emblem right there. Really just looks awesome. Uh, I really love these shoes. They stand out on feet. They look amazing. Um, they're really something that's going to last me for years to come. I can't say enough good things about these. Uh, fairly good price, you know, for such a high-end dress shoe. Um, absolutely amazing. And I hope you guys like these. I know they're not sneakers, but I got sneakers in Laguna. Um, and there'll be plenty more sneakers to come, as always. Something different. Something that's going to really last me for many years into adulthood. These as well. Um, I had a fantastic trip here in L.A. I hope you guys enjoyed being along the ride uh, with me. I'm going to finish up my night at BOA. And, um, yeah, I'll be back to Boston soon.